Hello everyone, I am Rohit and I on behalf of Sierra Vino Society would like to welcome all the teachers to one of the most successful and innovative idea sharing platform of India, ZIIEI, that is Zero Investment Innovation for Education Initiative. And today the chapter that I will be covering is known as If I Were an Apple. It's from the MCR report class 1, chapter 11, subject is English and the name of the innovation that I will be using today for covering this lesson is known as warm up. The main innovation and the motivation behind using this idea is to make the students understand the concepts that have been taught in the lesson and create and to create a vital connection with the concepts with the help of physical activity, which in turn will lead to complete understanding of the chapters. The concepts that we'll be discussing about are we'll be learning word preposition, action words, and word formation. The duration for this activity is 10 minutes. We instruct the students in the following manner. We tell them to stand in a circle and we tell the students that do as I do and say as I say. We instruct them that they will have to do whatever we do and they will have to say whatever we say. They will be uh, repeating after us. And we tell them that once we are done with the activity, we all will be discussing on what about the life of an apple. We, we do the uh, activity in the following process. We start with the poem. If I were an apple, we ask all the students to join their palms, showing and making a curve, showing the shape of an apple. And grew on a tree. We spread our hands, showing the gesture of a tree and grew on a tree. I think I did, I did drop down. We sit down, grounds down on the ground quickly showing the signal of dropping on a nice boy like me we stand up and point our finger to ourselves showing the sign that to ourselves on a nice boy like me i will stay there we nod our head giving nobody joy we uh, we, sp we smile broadly without two four fingers i think i did fall down we again crouch back uh, quickly showing the sign of sitting down and say eat me my boy then we stand up and complete the poem speaking out loudly the last sentence that eat me my boy showing the sign of eating with our hand this way we do the activity making the students uh, sing uh, rhyme the poem along with us say the lines and repeat the lines along with us along with showing gestures with the hands this way they will be able to connect the topic able to connect to the poem in a much more better way and when we start teaching the students in this way we get a lot of benefits um, first of all when the students will be um, repeating after us uh, looking at us and trying to mimic us it will help in developing their critical thinking and decision making skills they will be patient when they will be waiting for their turn to do the activity and also after doing the activity, we again initiate a discussion with the students. We ask them that, uh, where does the apples grow? Where does um, mangoes grow? Then again, we can, we ask them that, can you, would you like to say something about what will the life of an apple be like? We take all the responses. Again, we can ask them different questions like what comes before between S and U, what comes after U, etc. Along with this, we can also give them the idea of prepositions. And when you start implementing this idea in your own classrooms, when you start implementing warm up in your education curriculum, I'm definitely sure that you will be getting a lot of benefits apart from the ones which I've mentioned. And for this innovation, this idea, that's all. I hope you like this video. And if you want more of such videos from us, please do like, share and subscribe to our official channel ZIIEI. And also don't forget to download our ZIIEI Innovative Partshala app from the Google Play Store. That's all for now. Thank you.